Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. Come it like a cherry. Come it like a cherry. Your boy done switched up on you. Come it like a cherry. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look, if this is your very first time in this channel, run over there and subscribe for me. And after you subscribe, make sure you hit the notification bell beside the word subscribe so that you'll be notified each and every time that we upload a video. And then, welcome to the Lit Family. Now that you're part of this family, there's some things that I want for you to do. Those things are comment, 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 like, share, and don't for the team. Comment, like, share, and don't for the team. Comment, like, share, and don't forget to comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Don't forget to comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Comment, like, and share. Don't forget to. Don't forget to comment, like, and share. Okay, you guys, we're going to pray, and then we're going to get into the food. Here we go. Amen. How y'all doing today? How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? First off, let me let you guys know, Big Ben is on a sick day. So today, we're just drinking a slush from Sonic. Now, let me explain to you why. You guys, today we just have some vegetable soup and we have some grilled cheese. Oh. You guys, I'm going to have to be honest with you. <laughs> you guys, I'm sick. I don't feel good. I don't feel good, you guys. And mm, I really can't taste the food and I'm not hungry. I did make you guys a video last night oh i tried to make you a video last night no i couldn't eat the food i just couldn't eat it i'm not feeling very well i don't know how long this video is going to be um but i did feel like i need to come and explain to you because i skipped yesterday and today i held out long as i could so try to, you know, get hungry. But I'm not going to get hungry. So, I just decided I would come and make a video. And eat something that I love that generally, even when I am sick, I can eat. And that is grilled cheese with vegetable soup. Mmm. So far, so good. So, how y'all doing today? Are y'all doing Okay. You know, something I forgot about, you know, this was Martin Luther King's day this month, but there is another topic that I would like to talk about today because it deals with social media as well that I would like to talk about with you guys. And that is January is also an awareness month for slavery and human trafficking. Okay. So let's talk about human trafficking, you guys, because a lot of this definitely happens on social media. It does. A lot of the entrapment phases of self, I mean, of human traffic, human trafficking happens on social media. And I felt the need to tell you this because you have to protect your children. I think it's good to know what your children are doing on social media simply because these type of things happen. You know, kids, children, teenagers. You know, it doesn't have to be an innocent little child. It can be a 15, 16 year old, 15, 16 year old child that doesn't feel good about themselves, that has low self esteem. And these people, these human traffickers, they know what traits they're looking for online. You know what I'm saying? From these girls, guys, children. Most of the time, they're looking for people with wounded, um, you know, self-images. They don't look at themselves to be beautiful or handsome and things like that. Oh, you guys, this is a very, very serious matter. People are waking up with their children gone, banished, gone. 
uh, all because they weren't aware of what they were into on social media. Um, the computer is something that obviously makes our lives better, you know, as far as convenient, as far as, you know, things being at our fingertips, the smartphone, that somewhat thinks for you. Those things are well and good, but it also invites strangers into your home. It does. So I think that it's very, very important that we do speak on that because you don't want to be the one. It's easy to say, oh, that'll never happen until it happens. And it's happening. It really, really is. There would be no need for anyone to keep bringing it up or to have an awareness month for it if in fact that it wasn't happening. It really, really is happening, you guys. And that's a serious thing. As social media personalities, having social media platforms, you know, we are influencers to other people. I mean, that's just what it is. Our ideas, um, the way we live, the way we present ourselves to you, the things that we say, we're influencers to the world. We really are. And I think that a lot of people don't quite understand that part of it um, because it is a great responsibility. Um, you know, because you're an influencer of people. This is what you are. So I want to make sure that I use my platform to make sure that I keep you aware of some of the things that are going on in the world. Some of the misfortunes of other people will be brought up on this show from time to time. Simply because it's what's going on in the world. You know what I mean? And you need, I feel like you need to know. You know, as an influencer, I feel like that you need to know that your little girl or your, excuse me, your daughter or your son could be in the back room right now as you're watching this video on social media being preyed upon. Because it's very, very realistic when it happens. I mean, there's so many missing children in this world right now. Some you hear about, some you don't. High profile cases you hear about, obviously, because they're going to be in the news. Meaning, <clears throat> if it was to happen to children uh, with celebrity parents or governmental parents, you know, diplomats and stuff like that, you'll hear about it if it comes to them. But what about, what about Sue Ann from a little town in Arkansas? What about Jennifer Lou in a small town in wherever? What about all of those children that no one ever hears about? They don't make the news, but they're missing. These parents' hearts are hurting. All because they didn't pay attention enough to understand what their children were doing. I don't want that to happen to you guys at all. Not if I can help it and educate you a little more on what's going on. I'm so sorry, y'all. I have recorded the video all that way without the light on. Anyway. So the first half of the video looks jacked up. That's all right. Don't worry about it. And I tell you, I'm kind of missing on my beats because I don't feel that way. I really, really don't. But anyway, what about those children? You know what I mean? So, as an influencer, I do want to make sure that I let you know, you guys, be careful. You know, monitor what your children do online. Because to a child, something that may be perfectly harmless, they'll be done gave away your address, putting themselves in harm, in harm's way. They'll be done a whole lot of things not even knowing that what they're doing could be harmful to them. Mmm. At least it's too good. But with that being said, you guys make sure to spread awareness about this. This is the Slavery and Human Trafficking Awareness Month, the month of January. Y'all be being at a day off. He does. He got a day off. We've been having a day off. Because I've been having trouble keeping 
Like, for one, I just don't have an appetite when it comes to food. I just simply don't have an appetite. Um, and, you know, doing this, to do a mukbang, you want to be hungry. You know, you do. You want to be hungry. So you can really, you know, enjoy the food and eat the food. It's hard for me to... But one, I ain't gonna eat nothing that don't taste good to me. I cannot. Uh-uh. If it don't taste good to me, I'm not eating it. That's just what it is. So, without being able to taste the food, it makes it hard to do a mukbang. It makes it hard. You already don't have an appetite. Then you can't taste it either. Baby, who wants that? So, I don't know how long this video is going to be. But I did want to come and share with you and let you know um, that this is the reason why I haven't put, I didn't put a video yesterday. And this one is late today. <sighs> so, like, really? I don't want to eat this now. I'm just eating it. I'm going to try to carry on the video. But I don't want to make myself sick, okay? So, I'm going to stop trying to eat the food, and that's a talk, y'all. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, you guys. But anyway, I do want to let you guys know. Uh, remember, this was started off as Slavery and Human Trafficking, Human Trafficking Awareness Month. That is such a tongue twister for me for some reason. I don't know. Mm. But anyway, you guys, Human Trafficking... It's really modern day slavery. That's what it is. It's modern day slavery. It is where people, they find, like I said, people kidnap them. Well, it's not always children, so it's not always kidnapping, but forcibly, and sometimes it's not forcibly. Sometimes a person just don't know what they're getting into. They just don't know. And they think it's just so much wealth or glitz and glamour over there on that side of the situation until they get over there and realize that they have been enslaved to a sex trafficking ring. You guys, this is something that is serious and this is something that happens daily in our world. I want to bring it to you guys because like I said, I don't want that to be you. I don't want you to be the person that wakes up one day and your little girl, your little boy has run off or been taken or something like that. I think that is so important to let you guys know about. Um, I, I just think that it is. Not to take away from that, this month is the uh, Martin Luther King's Day month because that's always something for us uh, to celebrate. Um, great men that want equality for all. We definitely don't want to take away from that, but I feel like that this is just as important because this is harming our neighborhoods. This is harming our homes our loved ones and things like that. This is something that is happening. And I know you say, well, I live woo, 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 or where, 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 or wherever you live at. I live in this small town here and there. Um, and that can't happen here. Yes, it can. Uh, that probably would make you more predisposed to it than someone that lives in a big city where there's a lot going on. You know, a person lives in a larger city where there's a lot going on probably would be, I'm not going to say that it is. I'm just guesstimating Excuse me, y'all. They have a lot going on in the city. More things to do. More functions to go to. They probably would be more susceptible to um, things outside the home, if that if that makes sense. Uh, than someone in a small town that is basically at home and secluded more so than not, where social media would be something that would be their escape, okay? But it's not to say that this couldn't happen outside of social media, because it could. It very well could. However, social media is definitely one strong way. You know what I'm saying? Probably the biggest of them all of how these things happen to these individuals. So, again, you guys, I'm so, so sorry um, for not having a video yesterday. And I'm sorry that this video today is just... But you guys, I'm not hungry. I'm just not hungry. I'm just not hungry at all. I don't feel like sick, like I need to go to the doctor. I just simply don't have an appetite. I don't have an appetite. I don't want to eat or drink anything 
Um, but we'll make it through it, okay? We'll make it through it. I promise you we'll make it through it. We'll make it through it. You guys, make sure you talk to your children. Make sure you talk to your loved ones about human trafficking, about, um, you know, slavery, because that is modern-day slavery. That's what it is. Um, but anytime that you are entrapped and you're forced to do things that you don't want to do and you can't leave on your own free will, that's slavery, okay? So, I didn't eat very much. <laughs> I know it's probably not a normal lips video. However, I did bring a very, very serious uh, conversation that you need to know about. Monitor your children. Make sure that they know the signs and symptoms of anyone um, that is trying to get their address, that's trying to get where they go to school at, that's trying to stop them on their way to and from school at the bus stop, saying that they know their parents. All these things come into play of children being kidnapped and taken away from their families. Make sure that you have spoke to your child to let them know what they should do in those cases, in whatever cases that may be that you think could happen to your child. You guys, this is very, 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 very sensitive and, um, well, maybe, yeah, sensitive. I don't know what the other word I'm looking for. This is a very sensitive and urgent situation. For you to talk to your child about, okay? Or your sister or your younger brother or whoever. You guys, let's make sure that we spread the awareness for this. Because like I said, the month of January is also the Slavery and Human Trafficking Month Awareness. So now I've done my part. Okay, you guys. I'm going to see you guys next time tomorrow. I hope to be back with another video. Because I promise y'all three days of soul food. We're still going to make that happen, though. We're still going to make that happen, okay? We're going to still make that happen. I love you guys so, so, so much, and I'm going to see you guys next time. I'm going to see you next time. It's going to be tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to have to do another video like this, but I'll be back tomorrow, okay? At regular time, on our regular schedule. I love you guys so, so, so much. I'm going to see you guys tomorrow. I promise. I am. Anyway, it's time for us to go. It's time for us to go. I'll tell Big Bean how y'all see it. And y'all miss him. I'm going to tell him. Anyway, I love you guys so, so, so much. To all my new legion, thank you so much for being here. You didn't have to be here. You could have been anywhere else in the world, but you chose to be here with us. We love you so much for that. Mwah. To my existing legion, I know you were missing me. I know you was because I was missing you so, 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 so much. But here I am. I came to explain to you what's going on. I'm going to try to just keep hiding. But as much as I eat and the way I eat, ain't no way I can hide it, y'all. Ain't no way. I just come and tell you. So anyway, you guys, we'll be on regular schedule tomorrow. I don't know what we're going to eat. We're going to eat something. We're going to eat something. It may have to be something that's like this for a day or two until I can get my appetite back. But then I am going to give you your three days of soul food that I promised you. Anyway, y'all, we're going to get up out of here. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, y'all. You guys, look. Always remember that there's always more than one way home. When obstacles come up in your life, there's always more than one way home. All you have to do is get there. So get there, people. Get there. I love you all. And I'm going to see you guys next time. And if you're not here to watch me next time, you have lied to me. And I know you lied. Period. Ha <laughs> ha. Bye. Bye.